How to Use Applied Software's Renumbering Tool for Fabrication in Revit. The first option is Select All in View. When this option is enabled, all elements that match the filter selected will be highlighted in the current view. When this option is disabled, you will be prompted to make a selection of elements that fit the current selected filter. The next option is same number for identical parts. When this option is enabled, the renumbering tool will search the geometry and source data to verify if items are the same. And if they are the same, they will be numbered with the same number. For additional controls over what data is reviewed, ignore, select Ignore Fields and put a check mark next to the source data you wish to ignore. Select Objects to specify order. When this option is selected, you will be brought into a temporary view where items can be selected manually in specific order. Start number, input values, and a numerical value. When running, you'll notice we are in a temporary view select the first element selecting the last element will be brought back to our regular drafting views next option save to enable or disable the locations you want the start number to be saved to item number Item notes are both information that is transferred in the export of the fabrication MAJ file. The last option of mark will not be transferred in the MAJ file. The last option of tag item will place an annotation tag on the item. Tag item is using the family found in the tags and symbols. For additional information, visit www.asti.com forward slash fab for Revit.